Three, two, one. Whoa. All right, so we got the budget bullet time 360 rig set up. We've got the GoPro mounted on an arm and the whole thing is driven by an angle grinder. All right, so I just got back from the hardware store and they pretty much had everything I needed. And I got really lucky because everything fits together super nicely. So this is the plan. I've got the small steel tube and then over the steel tube and the bearings, I'm gonna put this smaller two inch pipe fitting. And all I need to do is attach the GoPro to here. We can't weld this just yet because it's covered in zinc, hydrochloric pool acid. This is your brain on acid, muriatic acid. Good to go. I think we're good. Now that I've got this welded on, what we need to do is figure out a way to make this spin. I've got this angle grinder. All right, so these are a bunch of old motorcycle gears. Let's say we put this gear on the angle grinder and then this gear on the spinny part. This gear has 15 teeth. This gear has 35 teeth. So how we can find out how fast it's gonna spin afterwards is we have 35 divided by 15. So it's 2.3. If we're gonna be powering it with this angle grinder, this thing has an RPM of 11,000. So then we just do 11,000 divided by 2.3. And if we wanna figure how many times it'll spin the GoPro in a second, we divide by 60 and we get 80 times per second. And that is pretty freaking fast. On like a five foot GoPro arm, here's the shaft for the angle grinder. And then here's the small gear and it fits on, oh, perfectly. And then the big gear to this right here at the bottom. Time to put on the legs. So this is where we're at so far. We have the base set up. We have the drive mechanism. And now what we need to do is build the arm and the tabletop for this. All right, so we've got two arms. One is gonna be for the camera. And one, if I can get it in here, is gonna be for the counterweight. Because look at how nice that spins. Oh yeah, baby. Now is the moment you've been waiting for. Let's test it out. I'm actually kind of nervous right now. It's so fast! We've got the GoPro mounted on an arm connected to a flagpole holder that's connected to this bar that has a counterweight on the end to balance out vibrations. So, uh, what do we do now? We're gonna try to get it right in the middle, okay? Oh, that was perfect! Not as many of them pops as I thought they would. I emptied out four huge fireworks. When that explodes, it'll make the water balloons pop and go everywhere. Let's try it. Woohoo! <laughs> For the next one, we've got Diet Coke and Mentos. That wasn't so bad. So what we're gonna do is light all of these sparklers so when we shoot this can, it's gonna explode. And three, two, one. Oh my God. It's okay. All right guys, now it's time for the grand finale. Oh man, this is gonna be crazy. And three, two, one. That was way bigger than I thought it would be. It wasn't loud. 